Faster, higher, stronger. That's the Olympic motto, and there's no activity that fits those ideals more than sport climbing. In 2021, the sport will go to new heights when it makes its debut at the Games. And this weekend, the final two tickets to Tokyo are up for grabs. These athletes are reaching for the ultimate early Christmas present, a ticket to the Olympics. To qualify for Tokyo would be kind of insane. Um, it's, it's hard to even process right now with such a hard weekend ahead. For the first time in history, sport climbing will feature in Tokyo in 2021. 17 competitors are taking part in the trials. Just one man and one woman from across Australia and New Zealand will qualify. Most climbers who started here had no idea when they started climbing that it would become an Olympic sport one day. So for them, it's just been an amazing dream come true. It was kind of a running joke, I guess, as a young athlete that like, I mean, was never going to make it to the Olympics. It's no joke now. Once considered a niche sport, this is the ultimate mental and physical test. Climbers will compete in three disciplines over two days of the Oceana Championships to decide the overall winners. The climbers have to compete in speed, which is about the fastest up the wall. They have to compete in boulder, which is about difficult problem solving, and then lead, which is about who can climb the highest. You need strength, you need fitness, you need flexibility. You also need a really good head because you're dealing with being in an unnatural space. The competitors have a range of experience. Some have been hanging from the walls for two decades, others just a couple of years. There are strong contenders from all over the world. The Japanese have the strongest team overall. Uh, there's plenty of strong teams in Europe, North America as well. So. You know, we're going to get athletes there and then they're going to give absolutely everything for Australia when they get there. Jaleesa Raps, Nine News. For breaking news, turn to Peter Overton, nightly at six.